Hello and namaste. My name is Tim Lee and I'm with the Center for Health and Fitness. And today we're going to do a little slow flow vinyasa yoga. This is good to do any time of day. It's a great way to feel good in your body. So starting with the palms together in front of the heart and with the feet a little wider than hip width distance, you can take the gaze down to the floor in front of you or if you're comfortable, you can go ahead and close the eyes. And beginning our practice by setting a sun kalpa or an intention. You can do this by creating an I am statement. Maybe something like, I am peaceful, I am calm, I am strong, I am healthy, or anything that feels right for you. Just choosing your I am statement and repeating it internally three times. After that last repetition, bringing the right hand to the heart, the left hand to the lower belly. And you can keep the eyes closed or the gaze at the floor, beginning to feel the breath moving in the body. Feeling the inhale filling up and feel the exhale letting go. Two more times like this, inhaling and exhale. One more time, deep breath in. Exhaling all the way out. And then beginning to connect body and breath as you inhale, open the arms out to the sides, maybe lift the heart a little bit, maybe look up. And as you exhale, come back into center. Two more like this, inhale, expanding, opening. Exhale, coming back. Last time, inhale. And exhale, coming back to center. And releasing the hands down. This time as you inhale, sweep the arms all the way up. Drawing a centering line, palms come back to the heart with the exhale. Two more, inhale, reaching. Exhale, center. Again, deep breath in, reaching to the sky, press into the feet, to lengthen up. Exhale, the palms to the heart. And we'll add on here, inhale, sweep the arms up to the sky. And exhale, releasing your arm down to your side. Deep breath in, reaching up. And exhale, over to the side. Stretching into the intercostal muscles here, the muscles along the rib cage, making more space for breath to flow and we'll move with the breath. Deep breath in, spin the heart up toward the sky. Exhale, circle the arm down. Staying here, inhale, reaching. Exhale, circling. Good, again, deep breath in, big circle. Exhale, this time inhale, sweep both arms up to the sky. And changing sides, release the opposite arm down. Deep breath in, reach. Exhale, take it over to the side. Again, spin the heart up. Breathe into the intercostal muscles, opening up the lungs. And moving with the breath. As you exhale, circle the arm down. Inhale, reaching up. Exhale, circle. Inhale, lengthen, press into the feet to get longer. One more time, inhale, reaching. Circling down and both arms sweep up to the sky. Deep breath in, exhale to the heart. And now Ardha Surya Namaskar, half sun salutation. Deep breath in, sweep the arms up. Exhale, open the arms, dive over the legs, bend the knees if you need here. Inhale, come up halfway, fingertips to the knees. Flatten the back and exhale, soften the belly, fold over the toes. Bend the knees here. We're gonna round the back and roll all the way up, slowly stacking one vertebrae at a time. Sweep the arms up on an inhale and exhale the hands back to the heart. Two more times like this. Inhale, reaching. Exhale, dive over the legs, soft belly. Halfway up, inhale. Exhale, fold. 
Bend the knees, round the back, rolling, coming all the way up. Deep breath in, sweep the arms up. Exhale to the heart. One more time, Ardha Surya Namaskar, half sun salutation, reaching. Dive over the legs, bend the knees if you need. Halfway up. Exhale, folding in. And bend the knees, round the back, rolling, coming all the way back up. Sweep the arms up and complete the salutation by returning to the heart. Good, release the arms down. Opening the neck, take the chin to the heart. Rolling the right ear over to the shoulder. Coming back to the heart and roll the left ear to the shoulder. And just rolling side to side here, clearing any tension in the neck. And when the right ear comes to the shoulder, stay here. Take the hand to the head. Gently press the head into the hand. Make a fist out of the opposite hand and start to roll through the wrist. Rolling in opposite direction. And releasing, taking a full breath in. Exhale all the way out. And releasing the hand down, rolling the opposite ear to the shoulder. Again, take a hold of the head, gently press the head into the hand, make a fist out of the opposite hand and roll through the wrist. Opposite direction. Releasing the hand down, take a deep breath in. Long, relaxed exhale. Good, releasing the head, coming back to center and a few times rolling the shoulders up and back. Again, clearing any tension you're holding here. Sort of giving that inner self massage. And releasing the arms down. Take a deep breath and sweep the arms up. Exhale, dive over the legs. And we're gonna bend the knees and come all the way down onto the hands and knees. So placing here the hands under the shoulders, the knees right under the hips, and moving through cat's breath. As you inhale, lift the heart and tail. As you exhale, tuck the tail under, draw the chin to the heart, rounding the back. Inhale again, looking up. Exhale, rounding in. A few more times like this. Awakening the spine, creating space between the vertebrae. And after that, next exhale, come to a neutral spine. We're going to walk the knees back a little farther from the hips. And clearing a little bit of space in the joints, start to circle around to the right. Clearing through the wrists, shoulders, hips, and knees. And circling in the opposite direction. And coming into a mini vinyasa, inhale, come forward, shift the weight over the hands, lifting the feet. Press away from the mat. Feel strong through the core and tuck the tail a little bit here have a nice strong core, nice strong spine. And you can stay here or exhale the elbows right alongside the rib cage, come halfway down. Inhale, pressing back up and exhale, take the forehead to the mat, child's pose. Repeating that two more times, inhale, coming forward. Exhale, halfway. Inhale, press back up and exhale, child's pose. Last time like this, inhale forward, exhale halfway down, inhale pressing up, and exhale forehead to the mat. We're going to add on to this, inhale coming forward again, nice strong core, lower all the way down to the mat, release the tops of the feet down, press into the tops of the feet, strong legs, reach through the toes, roll the shoulder blades back, find cobra. And exhale, releasing, drawing the hips back, forehead to the mat. 
two more like this. Inhale forward. Exhale, lower all the way down. Strong legs, inhale, roll the shoulder blades back. Open the heart, cobra. And exhale, pressing back, forehead to the mat. Again like this, inhaling, coming forward. Exhale, lowering down. Inhale, find cobra. And exhale, pressing all the way back, forehead to the mat, and pausing here in child's pose. Taking a few deep breaths. Maybe coming back to that sankalpa, your intention that you set at the beginning of practice. And hearing your I am statement internally. Stay here as long as you'd like. If you're feeling ready to move, starting to come up to seated on the knees, just to swing the legs around. And come to seated on your mat, scoot up toward the front of your mat so you can roll back. Take a hold behind the knees and go ahead and roll all the way down. Hugging the knees in and rocking side to side. I need a lower back massage here. I'm taking a hold of the knees, circling them around to the right. Circular massage now on the lower back. And circling in the opposite direction. Coming into center, releasing the feet down to the mat, hip width distance, walk the heels in close. And coming into a moving bridge here. So press into the feet as you inhale, hips rise, arms lengthen overhead. And exhale, releasing the arms and the hips down. Two more like this, inhale, reaching. Exhale, lowering down. Last time, inhale. Exhale, lowering all the way down. Pausing for a moment, taking a deep breath. And now drawing that right knee in and hugging it in. Straighten the left leg. And taking that right knee over to the left, twisting. Extending the right arm out to the side. In your choice, you can keep the gaze straight up ahead or turning the neck and looking over that right shoulder. Let the knee and shoulder feel heavy, twisting in opposite directions, cleansing and clearing out through the internal organs. Deep breath. Unwinding, coming on to the back and changing sides, hugging now that left knee in, straighten the right leg. Pausing here. And then taking the knee up and over, opposite side, twisting, extending that left arm out. Again, you can keep the neck straight, gazing straight up ahead, or you can turn the head, looking over the shoulder. Deep belly breaths. Allow the shoulder and knee to be heavy. Last deep breath in. Long relaxed exhale all the way out. And then rolling onto the back 
and opening up into Shavasana. Lying on the back, palms facing up, walk the shoulders away from the ears, closing the eyes. Take a few deep cleansing breaths before we settle into our final resting pose. Together, take a deep breath in and slightly open the mouth and sigh the exhale out. <sighs> a deep breath in through the nose. Exhale, sigh it out, letting go. <sighs> Last time, inhale. <sighs> letting go. Now rest. Slowly beginning to deepen your breath. Wiggling the fingers and toes, awakening the body. Maybe circling through the ankles and wrists in both directions. And then reaching the arms up and overhead, lengthening the body in opposite directions. And gently rolling off to one side, rounding the back and resting. As you're ready, press up to seated. Finding a cross-legged seat on your mat. The palms facing up. And again, you can close the eyes and take the gaze down to the floor in front of you. feeling all of the space that you've cleared and opened in the body. And bringing the palms together in front of the heart. Close our practice. The light in the highest in me sees and honors the light in the highest in you. Namaste.